Radical liberal ideology is uh, overtaking college campuses all across the country. Students are being told what to think and what to say by liberal faculty members while free speech and conservative opinions are being stifled. So says David Horowitz. He's the co-author of the new provocative book on the subject, One Party Classroom, How Radical Professors at America's Top Colleges Indoctrinate Students and Undermine Our Democracy. David Horowitz joins us tonight from Los Angeles. David, great to have you with us. Hey, thanks, Lou. Let's, uh, you know, it's no secret that uh, college campuses are by, almost by definition uh, liberal, uh, but you say that they're trying now deliberately to undermine our democracy. What do you mean? The, these are radicals. Well, um, the, the heart of a, dem of a democratic <laughs> education is that students get to hear both sides uh, of the issue and get to make up their own minds. It's uh, uh, in totalitarian uh, countries, teachers tell students what to think. Uh, but what we have here uh, are courses, for example, at the University of California, uh, described by the professor in the university catalog. Uh, the, the goal of this seminar is to learn how to organize a revolution and then it explains that it's an anti-capitalist revolution. So instead of examining whether revolutions are a good idea generally, uh, instead of examining, uh, well, this teacher isn't even qualified uh, as an economist to teach about uh, our economic system, students are being schooled in how to attack uh, and overthrow the American system. And well, I, I estimate there's a, there are a good 10,000 to 20,000 courses like this on campuses today based on did you, uh, what did we... You, did you find any courses where they were suggesting a conservative uh, 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 revolution? Any, no, there any are, countervailing there influence? No, no, Louis, yeah, uh, I, I've written previously a book called The Professors, um, which is about uh, the fact that there's 99% uh, or 90% of all uh, faculty in the liberal arts schools uh, are on the left. Uh, there, there's an effective blacklist in the universities so that conservatives, uh, either they're not hired or they're discouraged as students because conservative students get harassed all the time by these radicals. Well, uh, but, we but recently a, covered uh, yeah. the case of a student at uh, Central Connecticut State University arguing in a class that he believes, and, and it was, by the way, a class assignment, he and a fellow classmate arguing. Uh, that students should be able to carry concealed weapons on campus, uh, given the context of the Virginia uh, Tech massacre. His teach, uh, teacher and was decided that that was uncomfortable for her. She called the police and uh, asked that he be questioned. Uh, yeah. You know, I mean, we're, we're getting that's to a, a level of absurdity in this country. No, no, that's a calculated harassment of, the, of that student. I mean, um, that is to intimidate students from raising issues Mm -hmm. that their professors disagree with. Well, um, there's no question about it. And I think probably people will be surprised at what the ones you call your dirty dozen, the universities and colleges uh, where, that are the worst offenders. Let's, let's if we can, uh, we're going to put that up. Uh, Duke University, University of Colorado, Columbia, Penn State, Texas, yeah, the Arizona, Arizona State, a lot happening in Arizona, Temple, Miami, uh, a lot happening in Pennsylvania as well. University of Missouri, uh, University uh, 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 Southern California, uh, uni uh, Miami U. Yeah, Miami U. My gosh. Right, uh, and that's uh, Miami U. It's uh, 60, 70 percent of the student body are conservatives. It's a really. It's a, oh, that's a, a that's a headline yeah. in and of itself. Well, that's true, but they're all they, they couldn't name one conservative professor. Those student, I, I spoke there, uh, so I yeah. You say the worst university is the uh, the worst is the University of California Santa Cruz. Well, that's where that course came from. It has the uh, it has the Department of Feminist Studies. It doesn't even pretend that they're women's studies because no women's studies department or uh, women's yeah. studies there. Are we getting uh, a lot we, of courses on like men's studies and? There are none. No. But these courses aren't even <laughs> studies of women. They are recruitment right. for radical feminism. Right. Uh, the department was uh, architected by a well-known American communist, David. Bettina Abtecker. Right. David, uh, we appreciate yeah. you being here. It's always good to talk with right. you. We wish you the best. The book is One Party Classroom, How Radical Professors at America's Top Colleges Indoctrinate Students and Undermine Our Democracy. David Horowitz, thanks for being here. Thank you.